welcome back so let's discuss a cue card which is being asked in IELTS exams these days what is that it describe it like you liked in your child hood okay describe a toy that you liked in your childhood ek toy ke bare mein bataiye jiske sath aap apne bachpan mein khelte the so we would discuss uh, three things we would discuss cue card certain vocabulary कुछ वोकेबलरी विच इज एसोसिएटेड विद दिस क्यू कार्ड जो क्यू कार्ड के साथ जुड़ी हुई है या जिसको इस क्यू कार्ड में यूज कर सकते हैं एंड द थर्ड वन इज सर्टन फॉलो अप्स और इसके कुछ फॉलो अप्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट्स नो द सब पॉइंट इसके जो सब पॉइंट है जो बुलेट पॉइंट है वो क्या है what kind of toy it is it is so don't confuse ki ye to it is bol raha hai kya hai so you have to talk about the one you like to play in your child so it would be spoken about in past tense when you received it kab mila aapko jab aap 2 saal ke the 10 saal ke 20 saal ke सॉरी नॉट बीस साल के क्योंकि जो टॉयज हैं वो छोटे बच्चों को स्पेशली आठ से दस साल से नीचे के बच्चों को दिए जाते हैं हाउ यू प्लेयर विद इट योर मैनर ऑफ प्लेइंग विद इट एंड हाउ यू फेल्ट अबाउट इट आप इसके बारे में कैसा महसूस करते सो हेर इज सम वोकेबलरी विच हम which we can use jo hum use kar sakte hain inseparable inseparable separable jisko separate kiya ja sake alag kiya ja sake aur inseparable jisko alag na kiya ja sake to hum is word ko aur bachon ko ke relation ke liye use kar sakte hain children and toys are inseparable bacche aur khilone इनसेपरेबल है मीन्स हम उनको एक दूसरे से अलग नहीं कर सकते ओके प्रेजेंटेड गिफ्टेड गिफ्टेड और प्रेजेंटेड दे कुड बी यूज अल्टरनेटिवली एक दूसरे की जगह इनको आप यूज कर सकते हो मेमोरेबल मेमोरेबल और अनफरगेटेबल पुरानी यादों के लिए तो यू कैन टॉक अबाउट दैट इज one of my memorable moments possessive possessive children are possessive about their toys wo apne khilonon ke prati bade possessive hote hain i hope you know the meaning of possessive agar nahi pata to possessive ka matlab hota hai jab hum kisi cheez ke upar apna haq jamate hain और चाहते हैं कि उस चीज को कोई और यूज ना करे सो so, हम अपने फ्रेंड्स के बारे में पोजेसिव हो सकते हैं हम अपनी चीजों के बारे में भी पोजेसिव हो सकते हैं फ्रेंड्स इज वेरी पोजेसिव और सी इज वेरी पोजेसिव तो जब एक आदमी पोजेसिव होता है तो वो चाहता है कि उसका जो दोस्त है वो किसी और से बात ना करे अगर वो अपने टॉयज के बारे में पोजेसिव है तो वो चाहता है या वो चाहती है कि उसके खिलौनों को कोई और यूज ना करे और अगर कोई करता है तो वो बहुत गुस्सा होते हैं बहुत अग्रेसिव हो जाते हैं ओके सो आई थिंक द वर्ड पोजेसिव वेरी पोजेसिव आई वॉज वेरी पोजेसिव अबाउट माई टॉयज और माई टॉयज नस्टैल्जिक मेमरीज नस्टैल्जिक मेमरी पुरानी यादें बचपन की यादें एंड वन इज 
पार्ट विद पार्ट विद इसको एंड में यूज कर सकते हैं जब हम वाइंड अप कर रहे होंगे उसको खत्म कर रहे होंगे तो उस टाइम को यूज कर सकते हैं आई शेल कीप इट विद मी ऑल द टाइम आई शेल नेवर पार्ट विद इट पार्ट विद का मतलब होता है जुदा होना पार्ट फ्रॉम का मतलब भी जुदा होना होता है और पार्ट विद का मतलब भी जुदा होना होता है पार्ट फ्रॉम का मतलब है आदमी का आदमी से जुदा होना पर यहां पे जो खिलौना है वो नॉन लिविंग है तो पार्ट विद इट आई शेल नेवर पार्ट विद इट सो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू ए स्टोरी ए मॉडल आंसर ऑफ दिस क्यू कार्ड विच वुड हेल्प यू टू स्पीक fluently effectively and confidently i have tried to keep this cue card as simple as possible toys and uh, children are inseparable almost all the children like to play with toys and in my childhood i was crazy about toys i come from a middle class family but i have several toys but here i would like to talk about a special toy which was presented which was gifted by my father on my 7th birthday 6th birthday you can use accordingly and uh, it was a wooden car it was a wooden car there was a wooden driver in it there was a wooden driver in it and it had a wooden it had wooden tire it had a boot boot you know boot in which we keep the luggage jisko hum diggi bolte hain dikki bolte hain that is and it was painted in red and white colors so when i received it i felt on the moon because none of my friends had this kind of toy so all the children from the neighborhood wanted to become my friends because they wanted to play with that particular car wooden car so i became very special i became very proud of my car i and my friends used to play with that car uh, sometime inside the house sometime in the street we used to play for hours and hours we were so so crazy about it and one day one of my friend broke its tire and i was very upset i was very upset i did not eat food until it was got repaired until it was got repaired i didn't eat food and after that i never gave it to anyone so that was very special even today i have it in my suitcase whenever i see it it reminds me of my father's love for me it reminds me of my childhood it reminds me of my friends and it is very close to my heart i shall always keep it with me i shall never part with it so this was the toy i liked to play in my childhood i hope this will help you to prepare 
a model answer. You may speak about the same or you may speak about something else, but you have got some idea. So let's move on to follow ups. First question is what is the difference between wise and girls twice? In dono ke twice me kya fark hota hai? Okay, so what you can say? Yes, there is a try. There is a difference between the boys and girls twice. The, and it may vary from culture to culture or country to country. As, come, as I come from India, so I would tell you about the Indian scenario. In my countries, boys generally like to have tractors, cars, guns and other uh, aeroplanes. But if we talk about the girls, girls generally like dolls, Barbie dolls, kitchen set and several other this kind of toys. So this could be the difference you may add something more for example when i was a child i received cars tractors guns as gifts and my sister most of the time received wabi dolls kitchen set and all that okay do you think twice help in children's development? Kya khilani bachyo ki development mein help karte hain? So definitely they help a lot in their development. Because there are educational twice as well. And children learn several new things from them. They learn about the names of the colors, shapes, and uh, they learn other cognitive skills by building blocks, by making different kind of things. So I think that they really help child. There are several puzzles which are really we are which are associated with the toys, and when children solve them. They become more confident. They become more, more confident. Okay. Does modern technology have an influence on the toys? Kya modern technology ka bachcho ke toys ke upar koi asar hai? Yes, there is a lot of difference. A lot of influence of the modern technology. When technology was not there, most of the toys were made of wood. Fabric, uh, but now, after the advent of the technology, after the arrival of the technology, most of the toys are ultra modern. They are technological. Most of them run on battery. Many of them are remote control. And yes, these are really very expensive. As compared to old toys. So we can say that technology has a lot of influence on toys. Okay. Have we lost our hand skills such as swimming? Kya hamari hand ki jo skill thi? Haathon ki jo skills thi past mein kya wo kho gai hai? Gum ho gai hai? Definitely, because in the past, people used to do most of their work with their hands. But now, they are using machines for each and everything. They like to buy the ready-made, machine-made products rather than. For example, when I was young, my mother used to knit my sweaters and other garments for winter season but now there are very few 
people or very few ladies who weave this kind of clothes. Most of them go to market and purchase. So we can say we, we have lost the hand skills. Do children have many toys? Yes, as well as no. It totally depends upon the parents. Some parents are well off, rich, wealthy, and they can give their children a lot of toys. But there are some who are not that much rich or who are very poor. They may not be able to give that many toys to their children. They have toys, some have more, and some have less depending upon their financial condition. Last, is it good to give children too many toys or too many gifts? Kya bachon ko bohat saare khilone dena? Thik hai, ya galt hai. I think that excess of everything is bad. I personally think that excess of everything is bad. Kisi cheez ka bhi had se jada hona bad hai. Why? Because when, ha when we have too many, when children have too many toys, so they may never know the value of toys. They may never know their importance. They may take them for granted. They may take them for granted. So, they should, children should have twice, but not too many. They should be in moderation. So, this is what I feel. If we give them limited number of twice, they would know their reason, and they would know their importance, and they would not take them for granted. And they would wait for the next wire to be gifted to them. So this is what you can say. And uh, one thing I would like to say, try to quote examples. Examples. Okay. Examples drew the jekhaster ke follow up questions me. And uh, okay, if you are not able to give example in one or two, that doesn't matter, but try to give example in majority of the questions and pattern we have already discussed. First, second, third. Give yes or no. Give the reasons for that and also give examples to prove your point. So, I hope this video will help you to speak this cue card effectively and to answer these follow-up questions very efficiently, very confidently. So thank you for watching this video and don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you like the content and also subscribe, this, subscribe to this channel if you are new to it. Bye, see you later in the next video.